The NFL have invited me down to NFL Media to make me the new face of the NFL. Let's go and start this beautiful relationship. What's up, James? Oh, Michael, how are you, man? So glad oh. you can make it, man. What an honor to meet you, the finest quarterback, the, uh, <laughs> the Dallas Dolphins have ever had. Man, we got a lot of work to okay. do. First of all, we're going to start with the way we look. If you look good, you feel good, you feel good, you deliver good, so we got to put you in the right clothes. This you right think here? that's the one, really? What? What? Man, you look like Steve Harvey. I should warn you, you're about to see a ripped physique, yeah. which you probably don't see around the NFL because you cover it up with all your pads and your, you know? This is not unobtainable. Just some dips, crunches. Lose a bit of this. Yeah? Stripe on stripe. Stripe on stripe. Yeah. Really? God, baby. You're excited about it. Where'd you get these bigger shoulder pads? Oh, no, that really is true. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> I will listen to everything that comes out of your mouth when I'm watching you now. Are you serious? Because I think you're going to be thinking, What's happened to the rest of his tie? I mean, you've won how many Super Bowl rings? Uh, three Super Bowl rings. Three rings, but you don't wear you don't wear them. You don't no, wear the rings. Why? I, I don't wear them because you know I, I tell people, yeah, you, know, you win one, you wear them. But when you win as many as I do, everybody knows you have them. You don't need to wear them. This ring signifies a Tony Award. This ring to signify my BAFTA. This ring to keep the ladies at bay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then this one, just in case I get that low blood sugar. The great thing is, I've actually got a Lauren and Hardy audition after this, so I can go straight from here to that. So. <laughs> now, Michael, you've got to talk me through some terminology, because the last thing I want when I'm out there is to look stupid. Well, okay. we don't want that, right? No. First of all, this is a football. I'm well football. aware that you as America have chosen a different name for everything and that the other game, predominantly using your feet, is the one that should be called football, and this should call be like, you know, throwing in between commercials. Teach me about the, this one when you're down here. So you guys will both be here. OK, yeah, your I pants, think... Your pants are splitting. I think your pants are splitting. Yeah. So you get down start, here, you like start, this, start and then you, what, you twerk it out like that. Well, you twerk it out. That's right, right? That's what you're teaching me to twerk, no? I don't suggest you twerk on the football field. I give you some great catchphrases that always sounds good. You see a guy, you say, he gets stronger as the game goes on. Yeah, Should I do it in an American accent? Yeah, yeah, you, you he gets stronger as the game goes on, Dave. He gives it all he has. He gives it all he has. The best offense is a good defense. I mean, the best offense is a good defense. Yeah. You punk ass bitch. <laughs> is that the sort of I should be now? I might make board games my thing. This ain't Connect Four. This is the NFL. Everyone else is playing Pluto, and he's playing Jenga. Uh-oh, mousetrap. I mean, I've no idea what I'm saying. Yeah. You've no idea what I'm saying. Yeah. But I think we both realize that I'm probably game ready. Yeah, I, I, I think you're ready. Yeah? I think you're ready. You ready to get this done? Let's what's next. Let's, let's go get it, it done. Let's All go right. Here we go. All right, let's do it. Three, two. So it's still early, but we've had some guys get out to a strong start. Early season MVP pick. Oh, well. I've been looking at a lot of the field. A lot of guys have been leaving it all out there. And I MVP this season Aaron Rodgers because of the phenomenal work he's done with Olivia Munn. Welcome back to NFL Fantasy Live. I'm Michael. He's Akbar. And we have a new fantasy pun in here, James Corden. Right, sorry, guys. This is backfired because I thought it was a different kind of fantasy thing. thought it was like Dungeons and Dragons. Who's going to the Super Bowl? I can't wait for this one. I can't wait for the Super Bowl. I mean, who's going to be at the Super Bowl? I don't know. Taylor Swift, I'd love to do it. She would be amazing. Uh, you know, Adele's got an album coming out of Christmas. If they convince it, you know, anyone but the Black Eyed Peas again. Let's be honest. Give me your top three fantasy tips for this weekend. Brandon, Brandon Whedon's good. Uh, Derek Carr. No one's talking about Carr. I like that. That's strong. You're going deep, Pretty too. Pretty good. I like yeah. that, yeah. I always go deep on my fantasies. <laughs> <laughs> Two girls, I really. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. Sisters. Twins? They don't know I'm there. No? Yeah. He's playing Monopoly. Guess who? <laughs> Sorry. He's Colonel Mustard with the lead piping in the library. Oh, mousetrap. Where did I get the outfit? Yeah, where did it from? Um, I like the wizards. shoes, too. Wizards big and tall. Are those what big, wizards wear, those but, shoes? But you're not tall. 
but I'm big. They're playing with four pounds of beef and no one's got the buns, and that's the problem. Who's got the buns? Oh, he's got the lettuce. He's got tomato. Who's going to lay down, you know, part, half no. a bun, build a patty, put that on there. I like it. Swiss cheese, lettuce, but at least top of the bun. They... Let me finish. And that's, I think, what no one's saying about the Colts, buns-wise. Uh, Do you agree? Uh, uh, Thank you. What about Rodgers, then? Aaron Rodgers? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's yeah, a lot yeah, of people's yeah. fantasy. We yeah. all love Aaron Rodgers. I mean, who, you love him, right? Oh, I, yeah. would, I, was, I would spoon him until he feels safe and warm in a way that really? he never did. Because it's, it, it's really cold in Green Bay. That's yeah. why you've got to snuggle up. Akbar does that to me after the show. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> you got to snuggle up. Do you? He does, yeah. Do you spoon after the show. Who's in the front? Who's behind? Uh, who do you think? I'm pretty tall. This guy's behind, no question. <laughs> and this guy, right up front. This, this, yeah. this, now we're talking fantasies. Like now we're talking <laughs> fantasies. This has been... Thought provoking. Yeah, interesting. Throw the break. Coming up next on NFL Total Access, we'll be talking to, to a member of the Georgetown Jaguars who either throws the ball or catches it. Stick around, we'll be right back. <laughs> Great work, guys. Fantastic. Okay. Okay. All right. Nice. Someone give me a drink.